Night at the farm, written by myself, many German shepherds. A girl sits in the dark of the night, underneath a dim moonlight, picking grass covered in wet dew, for she had nothing else to do. The girl happy with what she had, while when began picking up a tad, with leaves blowing as the herbivores were mowing, for the girl was on a farm watching for any alarm, of predators taking the cows or horses who would scream in dark courses. The girl sitting there was relaxed, never needed to be asked of what she was doing or what she had been ruining. That though as the cloud covered the moon, the wind had died down with a creepy tune, as howls came from the woods not far, speaking to the North Star. The girls turned frantically to the sound as loud paw prints began to hitting the ground. Yet she couldn't see the pack as they were hunting for a snack. Paw prints stopped as the Kermit boys romped from smelling dangers from the predatory strangers, though nothing was there as the girl only saw air. The horses and cows ran for they couldn't stand the presence of something evil who had hidden in the airy steel. The girl started to sweat as she could bet that the presence of what she thought were wolves mostly were not connected to something so ghostly. She ran with the animals in fear as she heard the loud paw prints again with her ear. Howls sounded through the atmosphere as the ghostly pack were close on the rear. The girl stopped to turn to see what she could earn, if the pack would kill her or not, so she stood there as the pack came in hot. The clouds uncovered the moonlight as the girl stared with fright, for she saw the pack now, with yellow eyes and cloudy fur of snow. It seemed weird to see them, as they were growing, growling, barely visible in the wind's hymn. The pack stared with faded, glowing eyes, and keeps them low from the skies, bearing large yellow-white fangs as swishing cloud cloudy tails made loud bangs. The girl stood there, frozen like a frigid air. The elf of the pack attacked, yet this caused confusion in whether it was a fact, for the girl did not believe in ghosts, but she was down and not able to boast, for the ghost wolves of the pack did attack. The poor farmer girl, who never again will see the world. Thank you all so much for watching, and this is the 38th poem reading.